Shalom brothers and sisters. So, lots of news out of Israel today. Predicting war and strife, Ben Gavir has vowed to bolster the police and raise their pay. National Security Minister Itamar Ben Gavir said on Tuesday he wanted to significantly beef up Israel's police force and create a new national volunteer unit, warning that another war and ethnic unrest were imminent. So he's wise because I see that coming very fast as well. Ben Gavir told a press conference that in every meeting he had with officials from various security agencies, the threat of a second Guardians of the Walls came up. Guardian of the Walls is the name Israel gave its brief May 2021 war with Hamas terror group in the Gaza Strip, though the name has also come to encompass the race riots that took place between Jews and Arabs in many Israeli cities at about the same time. We need to come to Guardians of the Wall too prepared, he said. In such a scenario, there is only one advantage, strengthening the police and establishing a national guard. The minister, the leader of the ultra-nationalist Osma Yehudit party said he wants to add 4,000 new officers in the next two years, raising pay as well between 20 to 40 percent. Ben Gavir said 1,000 plus cops resigned over the past year, citing relatively low wages. It would be advantageous for police officers to enlist with respect. I call on all the police officers who have left the police in recent years. Return home. This is your home. Standing alongside Israel Police Chief Kobe Shabtai, Ben Gavir called for the creation of a national civilian force to guard the country, while promising to turn border police into a national fighting force. So some real proper developments there and really good ideas to bolster security in case of a new flare-up. Now, if we look at possible flare-ups that are coming besides the ones that are brewing right now with Syria and Russia and Iran on their doorstep and everything, the Temple Mount chaos that's going on and all those things, Passover and Ramadan are coinciding again this year. So from March, there's potential for chaos in Israel again, which will probably happen. So keep your eyes on Israel and keep watching here. Ben Gavir is shaking things up and increasing security, which is really good for the Israeli people and increasing pay. So I think that's a really good move on his part. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.